Good morning, everyone. Happy Saturday. Happy Stay Home Reading Rush Day 3. It is about 8 o'clock. Um, my boyfriend and I are going to go grab some breakfast at uh, one of our big favorite bagel places. They do these amazing bagel sandwiches. And then um, I'm going to come home and then he's going on a hike with a friend. Um, so I'm going to have the house to myself all morning to just read and I'm so excited. Um, but I just want to pop in and say hello, good morning, and I will check in with you guys a little bit later. Bye! So it is about 10.45 or so. I just wanted to pop in and let you guys know that I haven't uh, gotten any reading done yet today. Um, it's been actually kind of a busy morning. Um, I watched an episode of Buffy and then I finally edited and I'm uploading my day one vlog. And then I've been on the phone with multiple landscape companies because we are trying to get somebody out to do our really bad weeds. Um, I got my stimulus check so we wanted to use a little bit of that to get our weeds done because we've been needing to get it done for like months um, especially before we hit the summer and it gets really really hot so I've been on the phone like dealing with people getting quotes and things like that so um, you guys don't care about that but I haven't gotten any reading done yet today so I don't know what the today's reading situation is going to look like. I don't know if I'm going to hit my goal, but I just wanted to pop in and let you guys kind of know the update and what's going on. I hope everyone's day is doing well. I hope you guys are all well, and I will see you guys a little later. Bye! This is taking so long to export. Hey guys, so it is about 4.45. Um, I haven't checked in like at all today. Um, I have been spending all day trying to get my day one reading vlog uploaded. I've had the worst luck. I've had to export it. Now this is the third time uh, because the first two files were not working and it is taking forever to upload. I don't know why it's taking this long. It normally doesn't. Um, so that has been a little frustrating dealing with. Um, but on the upside, I did listen to the last 133 pages in And Then There Were None, um, so I have finished that. Um, I am giving it like a three, three and a half stars, I think. Um, it's alright. I'm not a huge, like, mystery suspense reader, so I think that really does kind of affect um, my rating, but I still enjoyed it. Um, but I do kind of understand all of the inspirations, all of the inspiration that we've had from Agatha, Agatha Christie. I feel like it has a lot of nods. Um, you can see a lot of nods to her, um, writing in modern storytelling, especially in like movies. Um, but I am getting ready to sit down and pick up Red, White, and Royal Blue. There is a sprint happening in less than 15 minutes so i'm gonna go ahead and pick this up my goal is to finish this tonight um i don't know if i'm going to but i am definitely going to try um because tomorrow i don't know if i'm gonna get any reading done um because my boyfriend and i are just gonna have the day together um and take our dog to the dog park in the morning so i don't know if i'm gonna get any reading done tomorrow but i'm definitely gonna try to pick up as much as possible in this um and i will check in with you guys a little bit later bye hey guys so it is 7 15 i just wanted to pop in and let you i am almost done i have two chapters left and i am so in love with this book i have so many feelings and i am just absolutely loving everything about this book um but i'm going to take a quick little break because we're getting a little hungry so i'm going to go grab some dinner i'm going to throw on some clothes um and go grab dinner and then i uh, plan on finishing this tonight so i will check in with you guys 
um, when I get back and when I sit down to finish this and let you guys know my final thoughts. Hope everyone is doing well and I will see you guys a little later. Everyone, so it is a little after eight o'clock. We got our dinner. I'm very excited. We ordered from one of our favorite Chinese restaurants and went and picked it up. Um, it's a local restaurant, which we try to do a lot more, especially now. Um, and I'm very excited. I got the sweet and sour chicken. So it's like an entire um, thing of it's an entire thing of chicken, and then you get your sweet and sour sauce, and then it comes with a whole thing of rice and. It's so good and the price is worth it. Um, so I'm gonna eat, watch an episode of The Flash and then after I eat, finish reading Red, White, and Royal Blue and I'll check in with you guys later. Bye. Hey everyone, uh, it is 9.15. I am done with dinner. I watched an episode and a half of The Flash and now I'm gonna go ahead and dive in and finish the two chapters that I have in Red, White, and Royal Blue. I am so excited to finish this tonight, um, and I will check with you guys when I'm done. Hey guys, it is 10.15. I did it. I finished Red, White, and Royal Blue. Oh, I loved every minute of this book. I'm so happy I finally read it, and um, I absolutely loved it. I came in giving it. I think five stars. Um, it's been a long time since the book has made me feel so amazing as this book has made me smile, it's made me laugh, it's made me cry, it's made me swoon, and it's everything I love in my contemporaries, and I am just so, so, so happy um, with this book, and I, oh, I just want to gush about it, and I just loved it so much. So I am off to bed, but I'm happy I finally finished it. And I want to give you guys my wrap up for day three. So at the end of day three, um, I have read uh, 285 pages today. I read 152 pages in red, red, white, and royal blue. And then I read 133 pages in, and then there were none. I have um, three books completed and three challenges completed. Um, I hope everyone is well. I hope everyone is doing well. Um, I hope you're staying safe and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>